a quick one guys in this video i'm going to show you some of the biggest samsung secrets so this secret does not only come with the samsung ui 6.0 it comes before the samsung ui 6.0 was released but if your samsung device support the new samsung os which is ui 6.0 this is going to be an added advantage and here i am going to list some of the features of the samsung phone you probably do not know so the first one is this let's say you want to turn on your samsung phone touch just swipe down like this you know literally if you tap the touch button you should see the samsung light comes up like this but if you press and hold the touch option you should see an option comes up then toggle on the option to turn on touch now you should have the brightness at this level with this you can just toggle on the brightness like this and like this so with this samsung trick you can increase the brightness of your samsung touch light another samsung feature you want to consider is this let's say you want to put your samsung phone into landscape mode or portrait mode that is the auto rotate now let me show you the secret press and hold the samsung auto rotate option and here if you see the auto rotate option include option to rotate on screen low screen and even on video call screen now once you enable all this feature as they were like this now click on the done button now let me show you the gimmick now come back to your samsung screen and then put your samsung phone in landscape like this so this is what you are going to see you can actually use your samsung phone as a second monitor on your device using the samsung device in a landscape mode you see that so instead of using the samsung device in a portrait mode just like this when you turn on all this samsung feature you'll be able to use your samsung phone in a portrait mode and this is similar to the new feature on iphone so we're gonna go ahead now and try this particular samsung trick another samsung trick you are probably not using is this go to your samsung phone settings so while on the settings you want to scroll down and come to display once you're on display scroll down until you see touch sensitivity so the function of this particular samsung feature is this Let's say I turn off this particular touch sensitivity. My Samsung phone will take a lot of time to respond to my screen touch. You see that? Unlo unable to unlock this with just a single touch. But let's go ahead now and turn on the Samsung screen sensitivity. Here, touch sensitivity, touch this on. Then let's say the feature. Your Samsung phone will respond to your fingerprint at the speed of light if you are using screen protector or screen guard on your samsung device do you know you can actually turn off your samsung phone or samsung galaxy phone using two different methods the first one is if you press the power button like this then you should see the option to power off your samsung device and the option to restart your samsung device alternatively if you want to turn off your samsung phone all you need to do is swipe down this place then swipe down again and here you should see the button to turn off your samsung device to do this just tap this I should see the option to turn off or restart your Samsung phone. So this is a unique feature on Samsung device that most phones do not have. Now, another Samsung tips you want to consider using when you are using a Samsung smartphone is called the Beast Buy. The Beast Buy is just similar to what we call the Google Assistant or Siri on iPhone on, on Android devices. Now, to access the Beast Buy on Samsung, what you need to do is go to your Samsung settings and then you want to search for Beast Buy. Then click on Beast by settings. Here, you'll be able to control your Samsung phone using your voice command. All you need to do is click on wake up voice. And here, you set up how you want to wake up Samsung device using the Samsung Assistant device. Hi, Beast by Beast by And here, you want to know how Beast by want to respond to your voice by clicking on the start button and follow through to set up your Samsung Beast by feature to control your Samsung phone with your voice. Then I'm gonna show you a Samsung trick no one is gonna tell you in this video. Now go to your Samsung phone gallery, then click on the menu option at the bottom right, this, click on settings. Now scroll down and click on about gallery. Then you want to tap the gallery version like 10 times. So just keep tapping until you see gallery lab is enabled, then come back here. If you scroll down, you'll see an option called the gallery labs. Then tap on gallery labs, then here you have options to control your Samsung Gallery Labs, include the option to lock album, 
option to save image as a pdf from your gallery lab and other features that gallery itself do not want you to know about so just bear now and try this and next another feature you want to try on your gallery lab is a feature to lock photo album on your gallery you can see all these albums are locked using my fingerprints you see that so if i click on this it is also locked now with this feature you can actually lock photo album on your gallery smartphone so all you need to do is click on the three line at the bottom right while on your gallery on samsung then click on settings here you want to come to about gallery then keep tapping the version repeatedly until you get the option called gallery lab so once you have the option called gallery lab now let's go ahead now and try this now come here press and hold album on your samsung gallery like this then click on the three dots above the more option if you see the option to lock gallery click on lock gallery and instantly you see the gallery locked on your samsung device so guys there are a lot of samsung features you need to try to use when you're using a samsung galaxy device and in this channel we discuss a lot of them so guys if this is helpful on the latest samsung tips and tricks that you can actually access on your samsung galaxy device that is running on the latest samsung one ui 6.0 you not try this so if this video is helpful you want to hit the like button of course you want to subscribe to our youtube channel for more quality videos just like this